All right, folks, I got a good feeling. Today's the day we take down Choo Choo Charles. Me and my sick purple demon train. Gonna battle the demon. I guess. <laughs> I guess. What else did we do? Oh, look, I'm right here. I forgot. It was just yesterday, but I already forgot. Hello. So, you have that thing on your arm, too. Has finally arrived. You know, my late husband built a gun to help fight Charles, but Warren's goons stole the barrels and took him up to their camp. Bob was such a brave man. Much braver than you, I bet. Uh, probably. If you take what I have left of the gun and steal back those other parts, you can put it back together to use against Charles. Just do me one favor, will you? What's that? If you do end up using it, name it Bob in memory of my honey. Okay. But really, I want to... What's the deal with this... Like, the other guy... There, there was another guy here who had one on both of his shoulders. Like, what is this? It's just a graphical issue, or... I don't get it. I suppose it doesn't really matter, but... I'm curious if it's intentional or not. That's all. Mob camp infiltration. Great. Stealth is my favorite. Nothing better than a stealth mission. Devil trade. I almost forgot I have to switch these junctions. Not now, 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 now. Oh, not now, not now. There's another junction I have to switch up ahead. Crap. Guess not. Just give up, bro. Uh oh. Okay, where are we? <laughs> I'm so close, see. Ambush me right where I wanted to be. What a jerk. Also, I feel like the flamethrower doesn't quite have, yeah, it doesn't have that much stopping power. Alright, no, sorry, rocket launcher. The boomer. Damn boomer. It's a little bit early. That's fine. Okay, uh, how best to approach this situation? Oh, uh, get the hell out of here. That's how. Did he turn around? Where's the dude?
door is locked. Crap. Okay, there's at least three of them. Oh, no. Uh. Shoot, I shouldn't have driven away. solver. That's me. Oh, train is hurt though. I'm sorry, train. I didn't mean to put you through that. You're a good boy. You're a good boy. Yes, you are. These guys, on the other hand, jerks. All of them. Ugh. What is this lump? Oh, it's a mask. It's even creepier than I thought. Wolf. Oh, wow. Look, they got a whole bunch of them. They range from terrifying to nightmare inducing. <laughs> Ugh. Uh, I think this one's the worst, actually. Ugh. They're all. Ugh. We've been digging for over a month, and I'm beginning to wonder what, we've, what we're really doing here. There are ancient stone ruins above ground, as well as ruins being discovered underground. Some sort of temple in a large cavern was uncovered at one of the other mines. Are we really digging for gold veins? Crap, someone survived. Ooh, come get me. You better hope you're fast. Oh. <laughs> you who? What was that noise? Is that the sound of victory? I kind of thought this door was locked. Oops. Ooh, a key. Nice. Scraps. <clears throat> and now 
not going to have these parts. Again, Bob. <laughs> nice. Yeah. I don't know if it's going to be helpful. I think the flamethrower is still the best bet. But, uh... I'm willing to give Bob a fair shot. Actually, I, I'm not sure which mission is going to be more important to do first, if any. But, uh, it's this little spot here. It's like a hole in the ground. Oh well. Oh yeah, I have coffee. Mm -hmm. Coffee. Mm. Mm. Coffee, coffee, coffee. Coffee, coffee, coffee. Coffee, coffee, coffee. Coffee! It's my coffee song, I just wrote it now. I know I could use a little workshopping, but uh, I think it's got a solid base. And, uh, yeah, I expect it to be top 40 hit by early next year. Wait, 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 what's this? Have I been here? Oh, yeah, this is the second mine. Yeah, I've been here. forget that you can look at the map while moving. Some kind of worship room. Mutiny meeting notes. I have discussed our latest battle plan with everyone, and nobody had objections. The whole crew knows what to do and will set the track's directions accordingly when the time comes. All the archivist needs to focus on is pummeling that beast, keeping his distance, and getting Charles to his weakest point. My father should be back within two days, at which point we can supply him and the hunter with the keys and other supplies we've gathered. We never wanted to take such harsh action against Warren and the other miners, but he's twisted our arms too long. Charles needs to go, and Warren won't stand in our way. Okay. So, I guess Eugene had offspring. Oops. I got some bad news for you, kiddo. Your daddy's Charles food. Stakeout Summary, Day 3, Location 4. I've been staking out this area for days, and Charles has never crossed the old wood bridge. Somehow that beast is cunning enough to know it's dangerous, but if he's angry and desperate, he might just chase someone across it. Then BAM! We use John's bombs to blow the whole thing up, and Charles falls face first into the canyon. If the blast doesn't kill him, the fall surely will. Okay. So we're... Uh, seeing the denouement here, spelled out. At least how it's expected to go. I can't imagine it's going to be that smooth, but... You're the archivist my father told me about. Although, 
I'm disappointed to see that he chose to stay on the mainland rather than return with you. Um. Not to say that your help isn't appreciated, but we could have used his aid as well. If you haven't already heard from the others, the mine boss Warren is protecting dangerous monster eggs that could lead to catastrophe. A catastrophe, in fact. While our main plan is to summon Charles into a duel and fight him to the death, we've devised a perfect trap as a precaution that may help defeat him. Go attach these remote explosives to each of the support pillars under the wood bridge out there. Then meet me back here. Hmm, okay. Yeah, so this is like... This is more like the last mission. Or prep for the end. I, I want to go in this room. This room has things in it. I see that it's blocked up. Uh, maybe it doesn't have anything in it. I thought I saw a scrap, but... Maybe it's just old Ryan being crazy! Easy peasy. Oh. Araniro. Municipal building. Okay. Oh, dang. I wish I had noticed before that run is toggle, not hold. Ugh. That's the tallest and weakest bridge on the island. So if Charles ever crosses it, we can blow him sky high. I'll be on standby to detonate the charges, but it's still up to you to summon and fight him. Here, take this. It's the key to the temple. Once you think you're prepared enough, you can break in and fight the battle of a lifetime. Okay. I didn't realize the temple was a place I had to get into. But, uh, here we are. Yeah, it seems like it's just an outdoor temple that I could walk up to and... Oh, this is different. Didn't I find a different temple somewhere? Is it... Yeah, it was this. I thought this was the temple. I might have to go back here and explore. Because I don't think I've been in this little shack either. Might be a paint can there. <clears throat> oh, get out of the map! Get out of the map! Definitely want to investigate this church. Oh, I thought it was a paint can, but it's just a bucket. To Mr. Reverend, today's sermon was a true inspiration during these trying times. Very well thought out and thorough in every manner. I believe I speak for the whole congregation when I say that we admire your confidence and steadfast wisdom as we grieve our lost brothers and sisters. Alright, not a lot of lore in that one, but... Uh, uh, ah! Pink can! Nice! Black. Sermon outline. God is very, very mad, I think, probably. Charles may be devil, 96% certain, always sneaky. Spider versus snake, spiders have more legs, usually. God always wins, hopefully. Sacrifices, ask for volunteers. Don't cry a lot, only a little. Closing prayer, clean up. 
Yep. <clears throat> that sounds like religion, all right. Nope, nope, that's not the right button. And this for map. And we... Son of a crap! Drive train, drive! Gotta put Bob to good use. Look, I'm not gonna lie, Bob is unwieldy. Uh, and Charles is getting a little more aggressive. <laughs> yeah, that's more what I was expecting. Leave me alone, you butt. <laughs> now we wait. Actually, hold on. Slow down for a second here. I just want to have a look at this northern section of the map, because there doesn't seem to be much here. Oh, well, there's a little shack. Okay, I want to check that out. Oh, here's a little temple thing, too. There's there's some things to explore. Well, most of it is on like this set path, but there's a few things to go out of your way for. That's nice. <laughs> and I just beat up Charles, so hopefully he won't be on my ass for a while still. And if he is, well, there's basically no penalty for death at this point. Hey, get out of here. Crap. That's right, keep following me. <laughs> you fell right into my trap. <laughs> I'm sorry, train. I didn't mean for you to get shot. Oh. 
kind of odd that there's nothing here. I would have expected something. Well, I guess there was a bunch of scraps. So, not nothing. Just... I'm curious what those little altars are for. If anything. Another grave? Frank Fisher. Yeah, paint can. Teal. That's a great color. But I think I'm going to stick with purple. Ooh, lore. I couldn't be happier with this job. I'm happy to leave any or my pickaxe swinging days behind me to work as a foreman at the Northern Mine Site. I even have the nicest little beach home to spend time in. Good fishing from the dock, too. Life couldn't be better, and I'm excited to spend many more years working with the crew here. Oops. Alright. Back to the actual thing I need to do. As I can make it back to my train, which is this way, not slightly more to the left. Just a bit of the hike, that's all. That's all. At least I have unlimited stamina. Oh yeah, this whole thing fills with paint cans, doesn't it? So yeah, there's like... Could this fit three? I'm gonna say one, two, three, four, five, six more? That's a lot. That is a lot. I don't think my chances of finding them all are very good. At least before the game ends. If it's like the last achievement I need, uh, I'll probably go back off camera and round them all up. But uh, otherwise, I think I'll just call it uh, Lost Cause. Move on with my life. Find them on another playthrough. I can definitely see myself playing this again in future years. Not right away or anything. Someday. Oh, that's a lot of words. <clears throat> At last night's meeting, Greg told us a crazy conspiracy about Warren trying to use spider trains for world domination. As part of the crew that worked in the temple, I'm far from convinced. While the prism was extracting the life energy from a batch of eggs, Charles attacked us for the first time. Not only did he fight like hell while the eggs were being destroyed, but he nearly doubled in size as he fought, as if he were consuming the energy. His legs grew larger and stronger while his face grew more distorted, right before our eyes. Those of us who survived couldn't even fathom what we witnessed. That was when Warren hid the eggs and ordered us to protect them. That was when he began to evacuating people. That was when everything turned for the worst. I know Warren has plenty of skeletons in his closet, but I can't help thinking he might actually be looking out for us this time. Oh. Okay, so my original theory that Warren is the Charles monster is clearly not right, but uh, it seems like he might also be a good guy? Sort of? Or a bad guy doing a good job of seeming like a good guy? All your radiant glory. Paul entrusted Yo. me with the key to one of the mines containing an egg. But before I give it to you, I have to tell <laughs> you about something. There's an ancient shrine on the island. A pyramid of sorts, with a curious prism located at the top. The prism seems to have been designed for one purpose. To destroy monster eggs. Three slots are carved into the prism, which perfectly fit the eggs. When fully loaded, 
A massive beam of energy is emanating, <laughs> seemingly drawn from the eggs themselves. The mutineers hope this event will lure Charles to a mortal fight as he comes in defense of the eggs. Now for the real warning. Charles has the ability to absorb energy from the burst, strengthening and enraging him. We saw it once before, and he may become even more dangerous this time. However, it's not my place to oppose, despite the danger. So, here's the mind key. Once you have retrieved all the eggs, and the key to the shrine, we might just be able to end this hell. Why don't we just leave the island, and Charles do his business? And what is here that we need to mine so desperately? It's way the hell out there. Um, well, maybe this is more like the expected point of ingress, but I'm going to come from this direction. Knee up on. Something like that. Everybody here still dead? Yep, good. Stay that way. Jerks. I got confused for a second there. I wasn't sure if I'd been in that building, but then I remember it's the bunkhouse. So yeah, yeah I have. What's that path up into the mountain? Where does that go? Oh, that just goes to the Charles Towers or whatever. This, have I been to this thing? Hey, weren't there guys patrolling here earlier? Yeah, see there he is. Assuming that my cursor is being captured. Of course. Well, I can't see very much with this giant X in the way. Can't see very much with this giant circle in the way. But I don't see any movement. So there may not be any sentries outside, which is helpful. Hell no. <laughs> oh, never before have I been more terrified of a train whistle.
seen him. Just gotta wait for him to come back around. Oh no, what? <laughs> oh, yeah, he's still coming. Ow! Please, sir, I don't want to be shot. Uh oh. Follow me out. Oh yeah, yeah, here he comes. Dakers! Dakers! Ah! Ah, uh, where'd he go? No one gets injured screaming out here. <laughs> Same goes for you, buddy. Not 100% sure how he saw me, but I guess they can see through boards too. Okay, hold on. Just a sec. I got to blow my nose. It's getting annoying. Okay. That should reduce my sniffles by about a fair amount. I think I'm gonna leave that in. <laughs> uh, maybe not. We'll see. It might be funny. Oh good, he's turning around. I thought he was gonna come for me for sure. <clears throat> Crap! I'm just going for it. I'm gonna shoot you. So long, loser!
just leave a little more space between us. Hurry up! You guys aren't supposed to turn around, you're supposed to go in circles. Jeez. How inconsiderate. Uh-oh. No, no, no. I don't have time for this. <laughs> Uh-oh. No one. <laughs> oh, where's my train? Get him, boys. Or don't. That would be fine, too. Oh, wow. I think I figured out what that hole in the ground was. See? Now he's given up. Good. <clears throat> All right. Off we go to the finale. Uh oh. If I had remembered that there was a junction switch that I needed to switch. Might be a little bit too on the thing. Uh I'm gonna back it up just a little bit more. Not that I think it really matters in this game, but, uh, better safe than sorry. Why, there's the temple right there. Yeah, I'm gonna have to do some murders. No one can you should have stayed in the bushes. Shoot my train. How dare you? Man, a cutscene. These don't happen too often. Just put the egg down slowly and 
lay flat on the ground. You'll hurt far too many people if you follow through with whatever you're planning. Oh! No! No! You fool! You don't get <laughs> Gotta get the screenshots. <laughs> nice. Hello, Charles. Nice. Ooh, we can teleport. Slow and steady, baby. Slow and steady. Oh. Oh. <laughs> it might be a little bit buggy. least that rocket launcher did a ton of damage but it's just ah! it's uh it's unreliable as far as aim and holding it back flamethrower does a much better job of keeping me safe which is my ultimate goal As long as I don't die, I can win the game. Even if it takes a long time. Oh, he angry now. Get back. Done, buddy. Done in rings. Nice. I, I like that we teleport right to the bridge. <laughs> oh. <laughs> oh. Nasty. He ain't coming back from that one.
That's it, eh? Yes, epilogue. I was hoping it wasn't just going to end. We're going to have a new Charles Hatch now. Is he like a, like a phoenix where there can only be one at a time? Or I guess it's like a unicorn, I suppose. Perfect. Perfect. Ah, oh, Choo Choo Charles. What? What? An excellent game. That was everything I wanted. And I wouldn't say and more, but there was everything I wanted. Um, it was a reasonable length. It wasn't just like two hours and done didn't drag on longer than it needed to. It was fun throughout. It had multiple kinds of gameplay. It had, you know, exploration, train driving, uh, battling, sort of, stealth, uh, the lockpick minigame. There was some platforming sections. Uh, like, there was a lot. There was a lot more than in your average horror game. Or at least indie horror game. So I and I appreciate that. Like there was an upgrade system for the train, and it got progressively more badass looking as you go. Choo Choo Charles, I, I this, I think the Game Awards were a little bit too early because you know they weren't able to uh, to get Choo Choo Charles in there, and I think it could. I think it could have swept. You know, I think I think with this is probably. Oh, this is definitely more Game of the Year material for me than Elden Ring. <laughs> I mean, don't get me wrong, I, I liked Elden Ring enough, but uh, it didn't change my life. I, I don't... yeah. This, on the other hand, I'll be dreaming about this one for years to come. I'll just be, like, having those fun memories of my time playing Choo Choo Charles. And then I'll play it again. And I'll never play Elden Ring again. Absolutely not. This one? Yeah. <laughs> It'll happen. So, um, yeah, that, that was Choo Choo Charles. It was, uh, it's a great game, as far as I'm concerned. And, uh, I really hope that uh, you enjoyed watching it as much as I enjoyed playing it. So, thanks for watching, and I'll see you on what kind of whatever comes next. Bye bye!